two, three, four. When did we start playing together? May. It was May last of, year. Yeah, because yeah. remember I was doing the play, and I yeah. remember we did a jam session. I was doing this play, and we did a jam session in the theater that I was rehearsing in. Just me and Alex. That was the first time. And Mike had a Craigslist ad, so I snagged him last. That was last autumn, right? Like November or something. Yeah, it was like late last year, and I think we had a couple of rehearsals maybe, and then 
we didn't really start doing much until this year, but mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Yeah, some, somewhere around there. Well, I don't know. I think, like, we've, we've spent a lot of time trying to figure out what we are, really, and I think we kind of settled on, like, we don't really know genre-wise. We kind of just, like, make these songs and just kind of do what feels instinctively right. For me, like, writing the songs, too, like, writing most of the song structures and, and the lyrics I write, like, I, I actually like the thing of, like, I know what it means, but I like the fact that a song can be anything to anyone, so... I sort of just wanted to speak to people in, in some way, like just for people to hear something in it that speaks to them and and it doesn't so I mean yeah, I want it to I want it to mean something, but it doesn't have to be one specific thing. I, I think we kind of uh, a lot of it is coming from our different influences as well. Like um, we've kind of come from different backgrounds a little bit, um, and then it sort of all blends together and um, I guess that's where our sound is coming from. I just had a donut. That was pretty kick-ass. Okay. So I'm just, I'm just going to throw it down. I'm going to say donut. <laughs> it's a nice wholesome meal. You got your vitamins, your minerals, your sprinkles. You know, all the good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> sprinkles, that's an important food. Um, hmm, yeah, that's a tough one. I like a lot of kinds of food, but I guess lately I've been really liking, uh, I've been really enjoying Vietnamese food, uh, particularly the uh, rice noodle dishes. I think it's, uh, they usually just call it like vermicelli or something. You get different things on it. It's a good dish for summer because it's not overly hot. I'm really hungry right now. Okay. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> what are you going to? I'm like, you, I like, want everything. You know what? Like, you know, that yeah. you know it's just going to please you. I well, I usually like I like to cook. I usually make like Italian stuff. I'm okay. a big pasta enthusiast, okay. or like a a curry or stew fr stew, stew fry. A stew fry. Yeah, yeah. with uh, with like coconut rice. But yeah, no, probably Italian. I is my all time. No turkey dinner. That's a, it's a three way tie between okay. those. Okay. <laughs> Let's pick one. So turkey. So is it uh, like it like is it spaghetti meatballs? Is it like? Oh. You know what I mean. Yeah. Oh damn! I have to be specific. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. Let's t let's say spaghetti meatballs. Do the whole lady in the tramp action. So not donuts. You're confusing me. Spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> With donuts. <laughs> With donuts. <laughs> and turkey. Spaghetti and meatballs and turkey donuts. Turkey donuts? Yeah. yeah. That's my favorite food. Stuffed in the turkey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It allows me to express myself in a way that I can't do any other, with any other medium, really. Um, I don't know. This is gonna sound really dumb, but I'm usually actually a pretty shy dude. Um, except for when it comes to making fun of people and myself. <laughs> and music allows me to express myself in a fairly somber and intimate way that I can't really do just by talking with someone, necessarily. Yeah, I would, uh, I'd second a lot of the things that Alex says, I think are also true for me. Um, I think it's a pretty much the only artistic way I really feel like I have of expressing myself. Um, and, uh, you know, it's, 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 it's a good way to, uh, to meet women. <laughs> Actually, can I change my answer to that? I really like that one. Yeah, I'm gonna waiting. go with that. Yeah. I was waiting for that. That's hilarious. Meeting women for me. <laughs> I was waiting for that. Yeah. <laughs> um, and men. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Women I like the attention, people. really. We're like really that. friendly, man. <laughs> yeah. yeah, in general. Um, I like when the, the focus is towards me and I have all the attention. And money, for the money as well. <laughs> Wait, we're getting money? What? <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, no, it's like, it's that universal voice, though, you know? It's like, it doesn't matter what language. Like, that's a very, you know, maybe it's a cliche answer, but I think it's so true, always, like, that people from other, from different cultures, from different, who speak different languages, or who don't have an experience, a relationship with music, even, sometimes. Like, they don't go to live music, but if they come across it, it, it speaks to them. It, and I like that means of communicating. It just feels, yeah, you, and you touch a place in your own 
you know, inner self that maybe you can't reach by other other means.